Everybody, you have to be good listeners. Ian, you have to speak up. Okay. Maybe with enthusiasm. Say your name and then you say, yeah. I would like to. Okay, you ready? Come. Go. My name is Ian Gallagher. I've written a scary story out of Mr. Becker's fifth grade class. It was a dark night. It was Halloween night. It was around 6 o'clock. I picked up the paper. As soon as I looked at it, as soon as I looked at the paper, I saw an ad for a Halloween dinner. It started at 7. And it took around 25 minutes to get there, and around 25 minutes, 25 minutes to get ready, and 25 minutes to get there. So I called my friends and my cousin. We all went. When we got there, there was nobody. There, there was nobody. It was a boat dinner. I took a step. The captain jumped down the stairs and said, take a seat. There, there was no menus or waitresses. There was nobody on the ship. We, we, had, we heard a loud thud. We jumped up. Um, okay, correct. It sounded like we ran, and it sounded, we went to where it sounded like a deep. I, I ran up, I froze. And I saw one of my friends ask me, why'd you stop? And pointed to his shadows. They froze. There was three shapes. One was definitely a captain. The other two, I could not make out what they wore. One of the shadows killed the captain, kicked the captain, and he went flying in the air and landed close to me. Blood ran down the stairs. We all were petrified. We tried to move, but we just couldn't. They started at the stairs. Our eyes met. My friends ran off off the ship over the fence and kept running. I looked back up. They took five steps down. I could not move at all. I could not feel my arms or my legs. My heart was beating like never before. The pounding hurt my heart. I stood up and I stood I stood up straight. I could not I could move. Instead of running, I took out, I took a step up. I didn't know what I was doing. I looked up. The zombie, it was a zombie and a sea monster. They, they took a step back. They started talking, up, started talking. I could not make out what one word it was. Make out, I could make out one word. It was die. They finished sentences for each other. It was creepy. I said, what? They said, sorry, that's our language. And they talked and took another step. And they said, if you are not afraid, we will make you afraid and die. I pulled out a knife and I had a gun. I grabbed, I saw the captain, I grabbed a gun and the, and the, and the on the waist and the waist pouch, I swung my knife and slashed the zombie's head off, and and into the water. It was the, the sea monster had a sword and swung it at my face. I was scared. I cut his hand off. He made a loud noise. There was a big dark hole. My friends. My friends surprised me and ran through the wood and had guns and a lot of villagers with fire. They gave me a shotgun and I went to the hole there and I went into the hole. There was a monster bigger than all the all he met, all all I've ever seen in books. Um he he rised up out of the ground. I shot I shot and I shot him in the eyes and I shot through his armor into his heart and killed the monster. He almost killed the monster. I, I shot one more time. Luckily it hit him straight in the forehead. I killed him finally. I came crawled out of the hole and I went to the hospital and so did a lot of my friends. <laughs> but we when we got out, we all celebrated that night. All right, yeah.